Good morning and welcome back to another video. We are currently on the local beach and you might be wondering, hey, but it's lockdown. Well, it's lockdown indeed, as you have seen that from my tiny intro. But since we are allowed outdoors for one workout today, I love to tick that box first thing in the morning. Now, a couple of words about my current routine. I'm either going for a morning run on an empty stomach, also known as fasted cardio, and then doing a home workout later in the afternoon, or just going for a run in the evening. But it's no rest day for me uh, as a consequence of being significantly less active uh, in general. But enough of that now. The subject of this video is how to eat just under 2,500 calories from only 10 pounds. And I'm not joking, 10 pounds. Very important to mention is no junk food though. So let's get that cardio out of the way and crack on. done with the cardio guys in this amazing weather and according to my app I've done four and a half K in which I burned 378 calories and it took me 26 and a half minutes so let's get to the shop now and do that massive 10 pound shopping see you later Right, back from the shop guys and I have to say that I'm hugely disappointed as I failed to fit in uh, my 10 pound budget. Even though I've done my homework, I uh, went online this morning and I added to the basket all the items I intended to buy anyway. Um, when I went to the shop, half of the items were not on the shelf. I would like to apologize to all of you again guys, I haven't meant to be misleading. All I bought today is six eggs 220 grams of tuna steak one fresh tomato no added sugar baked beans two bananas mixed baby leaf a small wholemeal bread uncle ben's golden vegetable rice some mixed vegetables and some chicken breast fillets. For everything you saw, I paid 11 pounds and 21 pence. So I'm up uh, one pound and 21 pence for two main reasons. Firstly, instead of two chicken breasts, I only found sliced chicken breast, which obviously um, cost me more or anyway, a lot more than expected. Secondly, just because I had to go for a different brand of wholemeal bread, I ended up paying 40p extra. And I would also like to mention that I wanted to buy broccoli, but instead I have to buy these mixed vegetables, which is again, more. Right, let's jump straight to the uh, first budget meal. I will have four fried eggs, 415 grams of low sugar baked beans, which I will cook in a microwave, and two slices of toasted wholemeal bread. I'm starving right now, so let's be as quick as possible. Right, we have an absolute beast of breakfast here, uh, which I'm very, very much looking forward to. It's uh, 665 calories, it's as cheap and as easy as you can imagine. It is definitely worth trying out this one. Right then, big breakfast demolished. Uh, I have two and a half to three hours till lunch. So I'm gonna go and do some editing and I see you at lunchtime. 
Right, I've been in the garden for the last couple of hours um, doing some work on my computer and enjoying the sunshine. It's currently 3.30 in the afternoon. So the goal is to have lunch in about half an hour because I'm working out in about two and a half, three hours. So I think it's time to crack on. Back now in the kitchen for lunch I have a half a kilo of uh, chicken breast fillets. I will season that with salt, pepper and paprika. Then I'm going to pan fry it. So I just chuck it in the pan and after a couple of minutes, I'm going to flip them on the other side. Of course, I will put a lid on the top to keep the temperatures in the pan. So just saving me a lot of time. To go with the chicken, I will have 250 grams of Uncle Ben's golden vegetable rice, which is my favorite, as you know, and 300 grams of uh, vegetables, which is a mixture of broccoli, cauliflower and carrots. The rice will need two minutes in the microwave, the vegetables will require four minutes and as soon as I'm done I will pour some teriyaki sauce on the top and I'm good to go. There you have it guys, 1160 calories. So please wish me luck on this one. Now we pour some teriyaki sauce on the top and I will fight this huge portion. I'm working out in just about two hours from now, but I really hope I won't drop till then. So I see you later. Nah, only joking. So the home workout is done, I smashed back and I'm pretty happy with how it went and with the end result as well. All I use for my workout is a door frame pull-up bar, a couple of 10 kilo dumbbells and an elastic band. Now we're back in the kitchen because it's dinner time and for tonight's dinner we will use up everything what's left from our 10 pound shopping from earlier today. Um, what we have is two in number eggs. We have 220 grams of tuna steak. We have our baby leaf salad, a fresh tomato, and I will cheat a little bit and I will use a garlic clove as well. Also remember the bananas I bought for today's snack. Uh, I had one of them before workout and the other one now straight after. So the dinner will be ready in no more than 10 minutes. I will start with boiling the eggs. That takes normally seven to eight minutes, if it's hard boiled, of course. Uh, while the eggs are getting done, I will chop up the garlic, I mix that uh, with the tuna steak. I add a tiny bit of ketchup, not too much. Uh, mix that in there too. And as soon as that's done, I wash the baby leaves, I put them on the plate, uh, I chop up the tomato, plate it nicely, tuna steak ready on the top and as soon as the eggs are done I just chop them up and it's ready to go.
here it is and as you can tell it wasn't time consuming at all now let's do the calorie talk shall we uh, this salad right here is 424 calories uh, and that be the two bananas I had one before workout and one after will give me a grand total for the day of 2470 calories so this is as close as possible to uh, the claimed 2500 calories so there you have it guys once again eating healthy doesn't need to be very difficult and it doesn't need to break the bank either today from only 11 pounds and 21 pence I had three meals totaling 2500 calories nearly and no junk whatsoever if you found this video useful please give it a massive thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel to get notified about the upcoming episodes but until then stay safe and peace out